our weapons to dominate the enemy team. What's up, everybody? It's Craze Barton, and I am back from vacation. Yay, vacation! <laughs> it was good. I, I actually had a very, very good time. Uh, if you guys were interested in that kind of thing, uh, what we did, uh, we went down to Catalina, California. And in last week's video, I said Catalina, Mexico, because I'm an idiot. Uh, but no, Catalina is actually just off the coast of L.A., uh, it's probably about 30 some miles. It's not it's not far uh, it, was, it was fun. We had a lot of good times there. I think my wife and the kids had a better time uh, They did a lot of shopping and I got to do a lot of bag holding Yeah, yeah guys guys uh, Especially married guys you ain't, anybody relate to that at all. No, no That's not just me. I don't think anyways <laughs> Had a lot of good fun down there uh, we also went to Baja, Mexico, which was actually, that was actually really cool because uh, we went down there and, hold on, can you tell me, how did that guy not die from the shoulder charge? How did he not die? Ah, you gotta love it. <laughs> Anyways, now we were down in Baja, Mexico, and we actually went to see the uh, blowhole down there. Now, if you don't know what a blowhole is, and trust me, it's not what you think it is, or what's going through your mind right now. It is actually a natural phenomenon that is only occurs in three places in the world. Uh, one's in Encinita, Cal or Mexico. The one is in Australia, and I'm not sure exactly where that's at. And, of course, the other one is in Hawaii. Uh, so, what it actually is, is that the ocean pressure and the rocks... Uh, that the waves go go against create enough pressure that it will throw water into the air 80 to 100 feet or so and uh, it's really interesting to see and watch um, it, it was definitely an experience to go and really see that so now I have to make a dedication to go back to Australia which I used to be there uh, I went there a few times um, and of course Hawaii so I can go and say I've seen all three of them which would be kind of cool uh, how many people can say that um, anyways uh, bound to the gameplay you're watching uh, this is as you can tell this is some Halo 5 Guardians uh, which I miss I don't know about you guys but I'm really missing this game I had such a good time and uh, I'm sure 343 has listened to all that feedback that they've gotten, they've done, and they've ran the numbers and seen everything. And I really do. I, I miss playing this game. I had such a good time uh, playing this. Uh, from what I understand, uh, with the uh, details and everything that they are incorporating from the feedback, I mean, we are in for a treat when uh, Halo 5 comes out. Uh, even if you do not like the basic uh, multiplayer matchmaking, they are giving us enough options uh, in the in our for custom games that you could play this game just about any way you like. You want to play it classic? You can play it classic. Uh, no sprint, uh, no anything. Uh, from that's from what I'm understanding. You're going to be able to turn off all the Spartan abilities and of course sprint as well. Um, so you can set your up your own speed and make a classic mode if you want if that's the way you want to play Halo 5 which is great which is great uh, that's what they wanted to do in Halo 4 but uh, unfortunately they had to uh, use mods and everything else to make that happen but on to again what uh, the gameplay is it's the gameplay is not me like going 25 and 0 and and it's like some crazy numbers like that. I don't play that way. Uh, if you're watching this channel, uh, you're going to quickly realize that I am not the best player out there. I'm, I'm above average is probably what I would place myself as. I'm a, I'm a little bit above average. I'm not, uh, not superstar or anything. Um, but anyways, the reason I like this gameplay here is that I get a ton of assists. And actually, I think I get more assists than I do kills. 
uh, mainly because I was playing with uh, my teammates here, and the teammates I was playing with was Cleanup, uh, Elite Assassin, I think Elite Assassin, and Rap Scallion. Uh, they just go off. <laughs> They, they they just would go crazy on this map. They just tore up this other team. Well, well, they had to counter my scrubbiness, <laughs> of course. But anyways, that was that, um, which was fun. Uh, I really, really enjoyed playing online with friends. And that's what I think is frustrating most people right now with Master Chief Collection is they want to play. And if you want to play online by yourself... Uh, you can get matches fairly consistently. So I don't usually have too much of a problem uh, getting matches, especially single player. But man, when I'm playing with partied up, it becomes an issue from time to time. Not always, but from time to time. And that's what I think people want. They just want to get online and just play with their friends. And it's like a cumbersome feature <laughs> in, in this. But... We have a patch coming out, and that's one thing I definitely wanted to talk about, is that we have the patch coming out uh, very, very soon. Is actually in the certification process, which basically means is that 343 is done with this patch, and they've sent it to Microsoft, and uh, Microsoft's going to look over it, see if it's going to be good to go, and then hopefully we will be updating the Master Chief Collection very soon. Uh, probably maybe even by the time that you actually uh, watch this video uh, which would be great um, because that's honestly what I want to do I want to get online I got a couple days off here coming up uh, this week I want to get online uh, with my friends and just have a good time um, so hopefully we will be able to look forward to that and hopefully it'll be a lot less frustrating for everybody overall so Please be expecting that soon. Now, don't get crazy if it doesn't fix absolutely everything. Because if you're thinking this is going to be the magic bullet patch, please don't think that. Think uh, it's going to address issues. Um, we may bring others to the surface. Hopefully that's not the case. But hopefully we're just going to have a much more functional and user-friendly Master Chief Collection. Um, that's just honestly one thing I've gotten sick of lately is all the incredible negativity, which, again, I understand everybody's frustration, but the incredible negativity is, it's, it's, I don't even want to watch it anymore. I mean, there's so many people out there that's, that's doing it and then, or, um, I, I just, I just skip your, skip those videos. Just don't want to watch them. Uh, so... I don't know. I don't know. They're not saying anything new, not saying anything that hasn't been said before, so I don't know. Anyways, as you can see here, uh, there's Rap Scallion. Give him a little teabag high five or whatever you want to call that. Um, I do have a couple of maps. Now, these are Forge maps on Halo 2 Anniversary that I want to really test and of course show you guys and do another episode of craze versus rap scaling now, this will be the final match of the uh of our little i wouldn't say tournament just our little 1v1 series uh unless of course it it really is popular and i might i, I actually kind of was thinking about doing that with more people uh see how that goes uh hopefully they don't murder me online uh, not too bad anyways but uh, if Rapscallon is up for it and wants to do one more match I definitely am, would be looking forward to that if it is possible um, hopefully we'll be seeing that uh, pretty soon um, but anyways this video here is pretty much coming to an end I've been kind of kind of rambling a little bit but just so glad to be back home. I mean, one of the things about vacations, man, is that you really do appreciate being home when you are gone for over a week. Uh, you really do. You really do. And uh, hopefully, uh, when you guys will get out there, uh, you can take your own vacations and have a really good time with your family. And that's what's really important. It really puts things into perspective. It's what's really important in life. And Halo broken unbroken it is just a game 
there are so many more important things in life that really deserve your attention and focus and uh, etc. Uh, I play Halo because I have fun with it. I enjoy it. I love the lore. I love the forging. I love playing online with friends. Um, that's what it comes down to me. Um, and when you have things happen in life, I, I think it really does. It, it puts those things, these little things, like it is just a game. Uh, it puts those in perspective, something you really need to think about. Anyways, on to something a little more positive. <laughs> or, you know, I don't even think that's negative. I think it's just being smart about life uh, in general. There's things to worry about. And there's things not to worry about. Anyways, uh, Rap Scallion, if you watch this video, please send me a message. Uh, I will be off here sometime this week. Hit me up on Skype. And of course, you guys, uh, hopefully, you guys will enjoy watching that video uh, coming out soon. All right, guys, looks like this video is just about coming to an end. We're going to enjoy one more Bro Fest. <laughs> I don't get the bro fest. I really don't. Thanks for watching, guys. This is LaCrae Spartan. I'm out of here.